Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Technology and today in this video tutorial, I will show you guys how to bypass TPM when you are installing Windows 11. As you can see here, it is showing uh, this PC cannot run Windows 11. So click on back option after uh, get this screen. So click on back option. Now you have to press Shift plus F10 key from your keyboard. Now you will get this CMD window. So here you need to put some command which I will give you on my video description. So the command is called a rage edit. Okay. So you just need to type over there rage edit. Sorry. Uh, rage edit. After I press enter from your keyboard and you will get this registry editor window. And here you will get a uh, lots of folder on your left side as you can see. So you have to expand H key local machine folder. Under that you have to expand system. Then you have to expand setup. After that, right click on setup and create one new key over there. So right click and go to new and then key. And it will create one folder over there. Now you have to change the folder name to new key hash one to lap config. Now put lap config over here, L in caps, C in caps, put lap config. After that, press enter. And on your right side, after select lab config from your left side, on your right side, you have to create a new DUR32 value. So just right click the new, then DUR value. So you have to put the name uh, called bypass B in caps, uh, CPU, CPU in caps. So I will copy this one and uh, CPU, then check C in caps. After that, enter. Now double click on that and value data you have to set one and click on OK. So as you can see, value data showing one. So now I will create another one which is bypass TPM, TPM in ca uh, caps and then check. Then double click on bypass TPM check. Value data you have to set one. Click on OK. Now another one I will create. DWA32 value, uh, name bypass, then RAM, then C in caps check, then value data you will uh, set here 1, click on OK. Now right click once again as you can see value data is 1. Now the last one is bypass, secure boot, S in caps, B in caps. Check, see in caps. After that, enter. Now double click on bypass secure boot. Value data you have to set one. Now click on OK. Now you have to close this one. After that, I will type over there exit command to close the CMD. Now if you will click on next. So as you can see, it's not showing that error. So I hope this tutorial will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button, like button and share button. And if you have any questions or questions then comment down below. I will see you guys on the next one next video. Till then bye bye take care.